In New Bern, the Board of Aldermen passed an electric rate increase on Tuesday. Nine of your side, Sarah Gray Barr, followed up with city officials and has more tonight. City officials tell me this increase was necessary because power costs are increasing. This rate increase would cover a $3 million deficit. I sat down with city officials to learn more. As the power system ages, the director of public utilities says it's unable to meet the growing infrastructure so needs of New Bern's expanding I population. Guess, uh, bottom line up front, in very general terms, um, we're operating at a loss. We've been operating at a loss since 2020. Currently, we're about $3 million. Currently, the city serves around 24,000 customers. New Bern's director of public utilities recommended a rate plan with a 5% overall electric increase across 2025, 26, and 27. This plan included riders to help recover both current and previous power costs. An alternate rate plan proposed included an 18% increase for 2025, a 0% increase for 26, and a 4% increase in 2027. Mayor of New Bern, Jeffrey Odom, says over the past 10 years, the city has actually decreased their electric rates on three different occasions. Cost have increased over the last 10 years. Our competitors, such as Duke, they've increased their rates while we lowered our rates. So now there's a bigger differentiation and we're lower than Duke by quite a bit. And that delta is really what's come back to bite us. In the meeting, the aldermen yes. unanimously passed a different plan altogether. It's a 6% increase for fiscal year 24-25 only. Odom says that 1% increase helps cover the deficit while also giving the city time to work toward a long-term plan. These electric rate increases are expected to go into effect on July 1st. To see those increases, we have them over on our website at WNCT.com. In New Bern, Sarah Graybar, 9 on your side.